Hey everybody and welcome to part 4 of Crash Bandicoot the Huge Adventure. I'm Nostalgia Scott and let's do start to finish. So yeah, you guys hear about North Korea and all the shitty stuff that they've been saying to um, uh, America and America back to them? Yeah, let's not talk about that in my videos. Because that stuff is lame sauce. Also, I really feel like I haven't had to use my death tornado spin at all since I've got since I've got it or uh, I think they just call it tornado spin in this game. Yeah, but I think I was supposed to use it there. Wait, didn't we just get in the last episode? Super body slam then double jump. Yeah. Never mind. We just got it. I don't know. I've been watching too many other games where like you get it. Now, you know what the funny thing about that is? Oh, come on, that's BS. But, like, you you get this ability every game. Like, you, it, you don't even just, like, get it once. Like, in the sequel to this game, that's the only power-up that is repeated that you have to get again. Anything over here that I can grab before, you know? Jeez. I just want to, you know, make sure I grab as much stuff as possible before I head on to the bonus platform. Okay. Yeah, I don't like those enemies. Those enemies are from Crash 3 as well. Now, I forgot to mention, but I believe... Well, I believe I didn't say it. But these levels are actually from Crash 3, like this type of level. Except, they weren't always like this. They had a lot of side-scrolling parts like this in the original game. But they were also, um, uh, like, 3D, like, head-on, going front to back. Which I always thought was kind of cool that these levels actually had a good mixture of both. Oh man, I don't, I don't like how the Wumpa Fruit don't make the, like, sound that they did in the original game when they get shot away from an explosion or from, like, you know, spinning into it. Also, that is a complete trick. So remember, there's three that we can't get, so I gotta remember that. Okay. How do I have a feeling I'm supposed to get that first? Yep. I totally called that, and I got an itchy nose for a second. Hopefully this level doesn't take too long. Yeah, you know what I did wrong? I didn't jump on the bottom one. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna destroy the top one this time. I didn't have Aku Aku though, so it wasn't like I was really missing much by dying. You know, it's a little disappointing, but whatever. Yeah, that's better. Didn't take as much time to go through. You know, I'm just gonna do this so I can then go over here. See, so you just have to spin once. I believe in other games you kind of have to pull away. In this game, you can just spin once. Just don't tap it. Like I said, there should be three that we can't get. Boink. Hey, right, now we're almost at the park. Now let's, uh, you know, not fail. One, and a two, and a three, and a four, and a five. Oh, then we got some of them just chilling here. Oh, wait, hang on. Secret. And three missing. Perfect. Let's go. God, so my phone has been dying crazy fast lately. I know you guys probably don't want to talk about my phone and stuff. But yeah, my phone has been dying crazy fast. Like, I charged it yesterday, and it lasted an hour. And when I mean charged, I mean I charged it for hours. Too full. 100% battery life, you know? Yeah, that didn't last very long. Not at all. Not at... Well, right after I get the checkpoint, I blow up. So, you know, that's the thing. Because my jump was, uh... Kind of underwhelming there. I kind of undershot it. So I apologize if you could hear that truck. I'm assuming it was a truck and, you know, not something else, but... See, I don't get why sometimes the bombs go off and sometimes they don't. Now, also, I don't quite know where the red gem is here. These space levels have always been my least favorite of all the levels in the game. Yeah, that's a truck. I really do apologize. Also, 
there's something up there, but I don't think it's an actual, like, part of the level. Well, maybe it is. Oh, man, you have to crouch double jump to get up there. Oh. Oh, there's a secret box up there. Not that bad, I guess. I think the biggest crash level ever had, like, 200 boxes, or, like, 201, or, like, something like that. I think it was in one of the, um... Like 3D games, not the GBA games. I don't think the GBA could fit that much on it. Uh, interesting. Pretty sure I'm missing stuff. Okay, maybe, maybe not. You know what? I'm not gonna even bother. I'm just gonna wait till I can spin into this guy. Same with that guy. Oh, can I spin into you? Oh, you know, you're gonna allow me to jump on you. Wait, we got everything? We got everything. We did get everything. Wow. Except for the red gem. So you're gonna have to figure out where to get the red gem. Anyways, uh, after I check my phone, very unprofessional, I know. Let's do air supply, the final water level. Wow, start off with the threats right away. Also, we got 49 boxes. It's not very many. Also, we have electric eels. You actually used to see them in the uh, sewer levels back in Crash 2. So it's kind of interesting to see them as an actual enemy. Like, you couldn't actually kill them in the uh, in Crash 2. Are you going to, like, charge or not? Well, screw you, you're not actually going to do anything. Like, I swear they're not even attempting to go electrify. They're just big, uh, small versions of these guys. I think these are like moray eels, and then those guys are the electric eel, which, funny thing is, electric eel doesn't actually belong in the eel family of, like, fish. It really doesn't. It's uh, it's in a different one, and I can't remember what type of animal it is, but it's part of, like, the- Oh, now you- now that one did a double electrify. Whoa. Wait, what? Why are they- see, now they're using their electricity. Oh man. I hate when my spin does that. Instead of going up- Oh, shite, shite, shite. <laughs> Instead of going up... What?! Did the one on the right get me? Okay, this is getting really weird. They're... What?! No! Okay, come on, game. Come on. You know what? Screw these eels. These eels are really just trolling me now. I didn't think they could reach me over here. They're not supposed to, at least. What did I die to over here again? Eels. And I was having an eel, sp eel spiel, and then, yeah. Die to an eel, man. Man, do you guys, like, actually have any boxes around here, or what? Nothing. Oh, god, I thought I'd die there. Those also don't hurt you, like, these spikes. They're just to, like, get you stuck. I'm gonna bring you before. I can't believe that was just an enemy gauntlet for that part of the level. Now we're probably gonna have a bunch of boxes again. Hey, a life to kinda make up for the one that I lost. Oh, shoot! So many. Oh, we're gonna have to go down and around? Okay. That's interesting. Normally don't have to do that. Also, very intriguing. But well, let's do this. Keep forgetting select is to actually check, so I don't really like to click it because select is just so out of the way. Oh, Aku Aku, you could have been like so much earlier in the level. Watch there not be as many threats, because at this rate it just looks like boxes. The rest look like I think they're going to be Nitro. Okay, there's that. Also, why did you turn to that side? Weird. Boop. Boop. I guess you could get the life if you didn't hit the switch before. Let me guess, just a, a few eels, and then the nitro switch, and then we're out. Why is this called air supply if it's a bunch of eels? Like, shouldn't it have been called, like, eel deal or something like that, you know? Something corny with eels? The entire level is eel and squid based. But no matter. We 100% at that level. So let's do the final blimp level, no fly zone. I believe it's a nighttime one, yep. Okay, we're looking at 56 boxes in this level? Holy cow, is this one gonna be difficult or what? 
I have a feeling this one's gonna be difficult. I don't like to get the uh, charge gates or like the boost gates just because sometimes it launches you too fast. There could be a box incoming. You know what, let's grab this one then. I'll grab some Wumpa Fruit. Ah, see what I mean? This one could have launched us past that box without us meaning to. Okay. So far, so good. Assuming there's going to be about, what, like 15 to 20 per segment? Because there's always three, three blimps you got to destroy. Oh, shoot. Doing so good not taking damage. And we took two points, four points. Anyways, we got some health there. Well, we're going to at least get like 19, oh, 20. 21. Well, at least we got health after we blew up. Okay, one segment's gonna definitely probably have less. Or about 22. No. That wouldn't really work. Like, what, 22 and then, like, less than all the other segments? I don't really... Unless, like, one segment's gonna be very heavily enemy-oriented, and then they're gonna go from there. I kind of really want the checkpoint now after we do this. A lot of people, like, get really out of the way just to dodge these missiles. They, you don't really have to do that. Also, these got a lot more health. Yep. Also, can your missile stop going really weird and hitting me? Also, he's got a gun. Sorry, Cortex, but your blimp is blown. Oh, yeah, I am like, are we not gonna have like anything in this segment? Also, health and more boxes. Yeah, I really have a feeling that we're gonna get like a lot of boxes in the first two segments and the third segment is just gonna be bowl. Like enemy bowl. Wait, did I destroy that one plane? Oh no, they fly up, okay. Wait, are those supposed to really seriously hurt me? Oh that that was BS man. But they pretty much give you a bunch of health right there anyway. You only need 20 more boxes. Man, we're going through these crates really fast. Oh, they're starting to they're starting to be blocked by the enemies. Whoa, come on. Like there's nothing you can even do about that either. Sorry, I had to take take my hand off the controller for a second, so I can shoot. Shoot. Man, I don't mean actually shoot shoot, I mean there's lots of enemies. Dude, can I at least get to him? Like, the missiles come so spread out now, it's crazy. Okay, thank you. Now, are you gonna have a huge gap between checkpoints this time again? Yep. Nope, not as, not as slow this time. We only need a 10 in this segment. Crazy. I almost got them all just from... Oh god, the rockets are actually hitting me? How are they hitting me? Come on, some of these last few boxes gotta be health, right? The last five boxes, can two of them be health? No. Oh, health! Yeah! Not, that's not much health, though. Oh, more health. Eh. Even more health. I didn't mean for all of them to be health, especially right away, but okay. There we go. And we pretty much... We almost had full health. Silly me. God, I'm gonna be so happy never to do one of these levels again. I think they shoot for like a certain time frame or like distance till you get a certain distance away from them. Can you like stop hitting me with every single one? Like, the fact that I'm not destroying any of them anymore is starting to really make me angry. But we did it. We did it. Thank heavens. Oh, god, text my sister got to answer. Oh, my girlfriend lost her seat at work. From the idiot who she works with named Chandler. No offense to the Chandler's out there. Wait, did that say 25 seconds? Oh, three minutes. I'm like, geez, Louise. Let's do drip, drip, drip. Requires nothing special. Right, there is no special gem here at whatsoever. Why did I do that again? 
but there is 125 boxes, which is... Is it the most or second most in this game? There might have been a level in, like, the previous world, like the first space world that was... Or space level that was actually more difficult. Also, bonus right away. Let me, uh... No, no point. Nothing that way. Wait, I didn't realize we're already 15 minutes in. 65 in this bonus? Whoa. Did not actually mean for that to happen. I think this is one of those really, really evil bonuses. Yeah, like that. How are you supposed to know that's there? Yeah. Woohoo! That was fun. Huh. Oh, darn it. That backfired. I did not mean to spin into that. There we go. That was skilled. Two. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, oh, poo. We gotta die. We might not actually be able to get the boss in this episode. I know why they give you this, though. Because of that one segment that you don't know that there's gonna actually be TNT there. A lot of people think TNT instantly kills you if you go, like, underneath it. No, it doesn't. That is also a misconception. I love watching people do that. It's like, guys, you don't actually die, by the way. There we go. Now we can ground pound, or body slam. I don't know why I want to say ground pound. You don't really ground pound ever. Woohoo! That was funny and glitchy. Oh, actually, I don't think that blows it up. Yeah, it does! Ah, I got a text. God darn it. Hang on a sec, guys. There we go. So unprofessional today. Oh, yeah, it was only twice, but still. I can't believe that happened. Like, I couldn't get over that, like, that one spot that I needed to. I don't care about tweeting about the first day of fall. Tomorrow the world's supposed to end according to Christians. Again! Like, why must it always end? Like, guys, we've been through world wars and the freaking Earth still hasn't ended, so... Come on! Woohoo! Still love body slamming like that. There you go. That's better. Silly game. Okay. that. You don't need to destroy those ones. And then you can destroy those ones. Anything over here I need to worry about? I don't think so. Not yet, at least. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Right. One, two, three, four, and five, and a one, and a Two, three, four, five. That almost failed me there. Huh. I don't know if it was safe to like do that or not. Oh, uh oh, it didn't really matter. No! Why did you do that game? <laughs> what was that, guys? Yeah, this is gonna be the last. Uh, level we do in this episode, sadly enough. Oh god, we could have had that done too. It was so bad, and I'm, I'm pretty sure the Aku Aku is specifically for that. You know what? I'm gonna do this while this one, that other one blows up. Still love that, man. I don't know why it doesn't get tiring at all. Hop to it, bros. There we go. Now I gotta do this annoying part again. Which is not one that I personally like to do. Whoa. I don't know why I almost hit it that time. 
There, no more tight jumps again for a while. Uh-oh. There we go, that was scary. Oh, that one just activates that one, okay. Oh god, we made it! And then that's the three nitro. Okay, I think we did it. Woo! And we got two Aku Aku out of that. Can we get a third one? Down here just for some invincibility. Man, this game could have really abused the whole um, super slide. It really could have. What's the point of climbing on that? Was there an actual point to that, or just a slide underneath the enemy? That seems like a waste of an opportunity there. Also another checkpoint and random bouncy box that we don't really need to bounce on. Not like we're going to need a ton of lives at this point in the game. There is no bonus world in this. And there's our invincibility that I wanted, so yeah. Also, we have to come back for it. Come back for that because, you know, invincibility doesn't really work on that. Well, we can just mow through everything until we have to go back. Well, that was cool. Now we gotta go back just for one box because the invincibility kinda screwed us over in that regard. Like, you can't really fail that because you're gonna bounce back up anyway. You don't even have to hold up. That's really easy. And I'm pretty sure there's going to be a checkpoint up here real soon. At least at this rate, you know? We only need 15 more boxes. Or maybe this... Okay, I'm like, maybe this level's just the, like the one level in the game that doesn't really have very... Very many checkpoints. Okay, yeah, Death of Nose has been worked, but still. Man, it sucks to be you, man. Oh, yeah. So this is like a frog level, pretty much. Hey, yo, frog, just... Okay, I thought he super bounced there for a minute. I thought I didn't actually kill him. Whoa, come on with the frogs already, game. Man, I feel like I've forgotten all the crystals, you know? But I don't think I have. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh no. Oh no. Darn it. I didn't actually mean to die there. Maybe I missed the box this way? Ooh. Like, maybe there's a box in the air that I missed or something, you know? Maybe the TNT didn't blow up properly somewhere? I'm hoping. But there's a low ceiling, so there's nothing like hiding up in the air. Unless there's something maybe up in there. Nope, that's not actually a hole or anything. Okay, these frogs will really gotta frog off, man. Like, see, these should be the last four. But, darn it. Yeah, I missed one. Gosh darn it. I'm gonna have to go back there for you guys. So anyways, in the next episode, we'll be doing the final countdown. See you guys next time. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.